Hi, it's Sean with Kiwi. We're gonna talk about getting your truck unstuck today. So when you've got packed snow on a parking lot, you wanna be careful about parking a truck that's got hot tires if you've been driving. You wanna pull in and park on that surface, sit still for a little bit, let the tires cool off, then move the truck a little bit because they're gonna sink into that snow and when you come back later on, you'll be stuck. If you do get stuck, your best chance of getting the truck rolling is to avoid spinning the tires. So you want to do a little prep work before you attempt to try to move the truck in the first place. One of the things that you can do is if you can find some grit to put underneath your tires, either sand or kitty litter works good. A lot of drivers will carry a small container of kitty litter in the cab with them. It doesn't take much weight and we're going to use sand today. So you want to look at this, the area behind all of your wheels because you might have those wheels sitting down in a in a little mini wheel chalk type situation where you've got snow that's in behind them so if they need to be cleaned cleaned out behind a, or in front of the wheels depending on which way you're going to go and then put your grit underneath it if it's a traction tire on a steer tire like that we wouldn't have to necessarily so let's go back to the drives here we're going to try to back this truck out of this parking space so we need to clean out behind the tires and get some of that grit underneath the tires. When the time comes to move the truck, you want to try to be careful not to spin the tires. For those of you with a manual transmission, that means being careful how you engage the clutch. For those of you with the automated transmissions, you want to engage carefully. And if you're sitting on a hill, one of the things that might get you stuck would be the hill assist start feature on the truck. So you can temporarily disable that by touching this switch on the dash and that'll turn the hill start assist off temporarily. And then if you think you're going to need some wheel spin to be tolerated, you can touch the traction control button and that will also allow the truck to tolerate some wheel spin and then try moving gently. 